What's up guys, it's Seema the Centaur Eang here. What you're going to be seeing in this video is me bench pressing, overhead pressing, seal rowing, front squatting, and doing some fun stuff. I'll leave that surprise for that, and it's a little bit of weightlifting stuff, uh, as an Olympic lifting stuff. But uh, that kind of leads me into what the subject of this video is going to be. Doing you. Doing what you enjoy in the gym. Um, and what do I mean by this? Okay, I'll give you three examples. Uh, I have a girl that's a client, right? Uh, she doesn't like to do cardio. She never has liked to do cardio. She never likes sitting on a machine, doing the Stairmaster, or the treadmill, or any of those things. And when she just thinks about cardio, she doesn't want to go to the gym. But a lot of people say, oh, it's best to do lists, or it's best to do miss, or whatever. What did I do? Or what did we do? We set up a way for her to do cardio in a fun way that she'd enjoy with a barbell. Barbell complexes, high intensity weightlifting, um, with very light weight. And now, what happens? She enjoys going to the gym to go do her cardio. Number two, powerlifters that want to be big. I actually have a few powerlifters that want to kind of look like bodybuilders. They want to look big and aesthetic, uh, but at the same time be strong and be able to deadlift and squat and bend some heavy weight. And the, the idea in a lot of powerlifting splits is that you don't want to do all this other bodybuilder work because it's going to kind of interfere with the strength gains you can have in powerlifting. Uh, the energy you use doing five sets of bicep curls is going to be wasted. And when you want to go, like if you want to improve on your deadlift or your squat, it's going to interfere. Well, yeah, that'll probably happen a little bit, depending on how it's programmed in. But if your goal is to be bigger and to be stronger then just do that you see you don't have to not do something because someone says don't do this it's not optimal okay if you don't enjoy it and it's supposed to be optimal then it's not optimal for you so we program in bodybuilding work oh my gosh along with powerlifting work and they progress because first off they like going into the gym to train they, they're not feeling like they're missing out on something that they would be doing if they, were, if they were just doing bodybuilding work. They get the best of both worlds. And they stay more consistent because they like it. Now, for you, and for me, okay, with anything you do in the gym, don't just do it because everyone else is doing it. Don't do what's trendy. I do strength training because I want to be strong. I do bodybuilding because I want to be big. I'm going to be doing judo because I've really always wanted to do judo. And I'm going to be doing Olympic weightlifting because I've always wanted to do Olympic weightlifting. But what's going to be the difference here? I'm going to be doing all those things at the same time. After prep is done. Is this optimal? No. Is it optimal for me? Yeah. Because it's in the goals that I set for myself. It's in the things that I want to do. Okay? So, whatever it is that you enjoy doing in the gym, think about it. Okay, if you enjoy doing upper body and you hate legs, then do minimal legs. You don't have to squat. Go and do a leg press for a set or two. Go and do leg extensions for a few sets. And then do your upper body stuff. Don't spend that much time doing things you don't like. Don't do things that when you go into the gym, you just don't like the gym when you think about it because you have to do that. Okay, do what you enjoy. So if you're a guy that wants to train or a girl that just wants to train upper body and arms, Go do what you like. If you don't want to train chest, don't train chest. If you don't want to train legs, don't train legs. Maybe train them a little bit, but don't do it like I do. Because it's not for you. It's not optimal for you. Okay, so if it's not something you enjoy, don't waste your time doing that. Because at the end of the day, not all of us are trying to be professional powerlifters or pro bodybuilders. We're not trying to be absolutely elite. Okay, so we're going to the gym for enjoyment so you got to do what you enjoy all right um yeah i think that's about it it's a very short video four minutes and 30 seconds i'm gonna let the rest of the video run where you'll be seeing me do some snatches at the end they're very ugly but i'm learning um i have one message though maybe two if i think about it or if i remember it I have a lot of lurkers, and let me, let me kind of describe what a lurker is. You'll come and you'll watch this video. Maybe you'll thumbs up this video, but you won't leave a comment. I don't know if you've noticed, but I usually respond to all of the comments I have in the 
in the comments below. So what I want you to do is if you came here and you're seeing me say these words right now, go down to the comment box and say hi. Say something. Say, oh, cool, Marvel poster in the background, or how are you doing today? I'll say hi back. Say something. Ask me a question. Let me know what kind of video you want me to do. No weird shit. Um, but just say something. I want to know who you are, okay? Yeah, but I think I'm going to leave it there. I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Leave some ideas, comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at The Natty Professor. This is Insema from Break the Bar. This camera has really damn good quality. I'll talk to you all soon.